Okay guys, on this video I'm going to cover adjusting the contact, the electrical contact on the atomizer for the revolver infinity ion. When you screw the battery onto the atomizer, these two copper contacts must come into contact with each other and they have to make firm contact. The threads on the battery and the threads on the atomizer are the positive terminals the copper parts of the negative terminals on the ion. I made a, a schematic, sorry for my poor artwork, but I did make a schematic on the website in the picture section that shows that underneath this copper contact there is a silicone or really soft rubber insulator that insulates the negative and positive from each other. Now that offers a nice spring effect that shows the two contacts together once they're screwed and mated properly. Sometimes that gets compressed and smashed together and then you don't get a good contact. Now you have your paper clip, <clears throat> it's a broken paper clip, bent, you know, a little hook. And what you want to do is you want to go inside the atomizer in the hole there and just slightly tug up a little bit by angling the paper clip like so. Work in a circle. <clears throat> You're just going to move it up just a little bit. M be very careful because underneath that it's soldered to the electronics inside the atomizer and inside the battery. Then you just repeat the same thing on the battery. Just pull it up just a little bit. Just like so. Rotate a little bit. Rotate a little bit. And pull it up. And that's all there really is to it. You do the, both the atomizer and the battery the same way. And when you screw them together, you should have good contact. See? Good to go. <clears throat> and that's it for this video tutorial. Thank you for watching.